morning guys today is tuesday it is 9 24 a.m i'm gonna walk over to a nail place that is not too far from me i think it's like half a mile walk it's not far at all so i think i'm gonna go there and just get my nails done i know i got them done literally not too long ago but three of them already broke and it's driving me crazy so i'm just gonna go my nails done not my toes because my toes are still good from last time i've never been to this nail place so i'm kind of excited to see how it is online it looks very fancy so i'm not sure how much it is because the prices aren't shown online you know what we're gonna go one time if it's a lot then next time i'll just know not to go there but we're gonna go check it out and i'm very excited because it looks so cute on the inside and i don't know if i'm gonna film because i get so anxious filming in public and i hate it so much so i don't know how much i'll be able to film but we'll see guys this book has been taking me forever to read so i'm gonna listen to the audiobook on my walk over to the nail place i mean it's a good book but the beginning was so slow and now it's actually getting better and i'm almost done but man taking me forever such an amazing morning i walked over to get my nails done they look fantastic my nails came out so good i'm obsessed i honestly think i'm gonna be going there from now on to get my nails done because it was walking distance it just feels so nice outside to walk around and then after i got my nails done i went to a little cafe that you guys kind of saw very little of it's called cracked it's brand new and the sandwich was pretty good the coffee wasn't my favorite but maybe it was just the one i got i had asked him when i was ordering like Oh, what do you recommend for coffee and he said um the cereal milk one so i tried that one it wasn't the best coffee but it wasn't the worst i still drank a lot of it but i got a small and it seemed pretty big and if i drank that much it would mess up my stomach so i didn't finish it but it was so good i loved walking to be able to get my nails done and then i just walked around a little bit i was on the phone i was on facetime with my boyfriend while walking it just felt nice but anyways i'm back it's 11 35 right now i'm gonna be doing some editing now and i think i'm gonna post the last vlog that's up before this one so i think i'm gonna finish making my thumbnail for that and then post it asap but yeah and i just got some packages downstairs let me show you so i got this package from beauty stat they sent me their wrinkle relaxing moisturizer being frenchy sent me their exclusive new items that hasn't even launched yet and i'm so excited it smells so good guys i just sprayed it it smells so good so i'll definitely be buying this because it smells delicious and then look how cute this is from hair proud oh my god it's like a little comic book it's so cute let me open it for you guys like this is so cute this is a glass heat activated smooth and shine spray they also sent me all-inclusive 501 protection milk they sent me their revive and repair shampoo and the revive and repair conditioner and it's so cute i'm so excited to try these out i love trying new hair products plus i actually just ran out of my nature lab shampoo and conditioner so maybe i'll try these out i also have some more packages here that actually i received the other day i got the new sol de janeiro perfume mist and guys this one actually smells so good i've seen a lot of like mixed reviews about it because a lot of people don't like it and a lot of people do like it i personally love it and i noticed that this one actually lasts longer on my skin than the other sol de janeiro like body mist this one actually like i still smell it on me and i sprayed it like this morning so definitely love this they also sent me their body butter and then the classic brazilian bum bum cream which this is just so good so never can go wrong with that paula's choice sent me their pore reducing toner which i'm excited to try this out because my pores are so big and i hate them then they sent me their new six percent mandelic acid plus two percent lactic acid liquid exfoliant I haven't tried this out, but I've heard good reviews about it. And then they also sent me their Hyaluronic Acid Booster, which excited to try this out. Love them. And then Tree Hut sent me a package. I love Tree Hut so much. They have such amazing smelling things. They sent me their new Pink Hibiscus Sugar Scrub. Their Do Daisy Sugar Scrub and then Moroccan Rose Body Lotion, which guys, I just open these to smell these and they're so good. I think this one might be my new favorite, but this one also smells really good. But Do Dewy Daisy mm, smells delicious. I'm going to take some quick pictures of my PR that I just got and post them on my Instagram story. If you guys aren't following me on Instagram, go follow me. I post a lot of stories. I try to post every day on my story and then I also try to post an Instagram reel every single day. So if you guys aren't following me, go follow me. But I'm going to post these pictures now and then we're going to do some computer work. Thank 
restaurants over there and it's like nice to walk around so we're gonna find a restaurant around there all right it's a bit later I'm gonna be filming some short form content now. So that's what I wanna spend the time doing. I think I'm just gonna film like two videos right now. I have therapy in about two hours, so I have some time to kill. And then after my therapy, I'm gonna head over to my parents' house because tomorrow morning at like 9 a.m. I have a doctor's appointment. It's just a regular annual visit. For the people that are new here, I live 45 minutes away from my parents and my doctor's around them, so I'd rather just sleep over there tonight. That way I don't have to wake up super early tomorrow morning and head to my doctor's. That's what's happening today. I got the cutest cutting board. Okay, I don't know why there's a little stain on it from yesterday, I guess. But I got the cutest cutting board and I'm obsessed. I got it from Amazon. I'll link it down below. But it's a heart. I love it so much. So I just keep it there. Those are my cutting boards. Actually, this one's my friend's and she actually left it here. But for now, I have it there. But it's just so cute. All right, guys, I'm going to go real quick to Target. I have a Target pickup order that I need to just pick up. And yeah, I forgot even what I got. I got like white vinegar. I got some Dove soap that I needed. And then just a few other essentials. It wasn't anything crazy. I just parked at Target. But I think after I'm going to be driving through the drive through um, car wash. Because after my trip to Orlando, my car has so many bugs on the outside of it. So I kind of just need to go through the car wash and get it cleaned off so it doesn't ruin the paint. And it's been like a few days, so I'm scared that they're stuck. But you guys, I don't know if you guys could see my windshield. Probably not, but it's full of bugs right now. Hi, it's 8176. And where are you putting this? Uh, I can just grab it. Okay. Thank you. Mm, Thank you so much. Bad. Thank you. You love well. Got all my goodies. Also, I've been jamming out to JB. Alright guys, so I'm back and I'm going to try the lead tester swabs on my Stanley Cup. Like I said in my last vlog, I've been getting so many comments about it, so I'm finally going to try it, see if there's lead detected. I really hope not. I've been honestly scared to drink out of it, but I hope it's there's no lead. But this is the kit. If it's orange, if the tip is orange, there's no lead detected, and if the tip is this color, there's lead detected. Okay, it looks like there's no lead detected, thank god. I was freaking out, but we're good! The Stanley Cup, at least mine. I do believe that online it says if your cup is heavily damaged, then the lead might like seep out. So if you have like dropped your cup or like the bottom is damaged, I would try this out or just get a new one. Alright, I'm all comfy cozy. I just put a sweatshirt on and I'm ready for my therapy session. I always get a little nervous before therapy because I just recently started it. Like just talking to someone about like certain things, it's just like, I don't know, it feels weird, but like at the same same time like good because you're getting like an outside perspective of everything and yeah feels good but it is 4 15 i have therapy in 15 minutes so i'm just gonna do some editing now i'm gonna edit the video i just did of the lead tester and show everybody that i'm not getting lead poisoning because i've gotten a lot of comments about how i'm gonna get lead poisoning how i'm drinking lead when my cup is lead free so just saying hey buddy after i finish therapy we're gonna go to grandma's okay we're gonna go see grandma and grandpa and luna are you excited? Just finished my therapy and now I'm eating a little think bar because I'm starving. But I'm gonna start packing to go to my parents' house. But yeah, that's it. That's all I had to say. So this is the bar I'm having. It's the think brownie crunch one. High protein and it's so good. This is my overnight bag that I use whenever I go to my parents or if I'm going on like a quick trip. I don't have to take my whole suitcase, but it's so nice. It's so big on the bottom. It has storage for shoes and this storage is huge. And then it has a ton of space inside for like everything. I'm obsessed with this bag. I love it. And if you're traveling, you can use this as a carry-on because it has like 
the little sliding thing that you could put through your suitcase handle kind of thing so it's so good i definitely recommend it i'll link it down below i got it from amazon and it's kind of like a dupe of the base one i think it's smaller honestly but it's honestly it works for me this is my second one because my pink one that i had i ended up stuffing too much stuff in it and it broke but i've learned my lesson plus it even comes with this so you could charge your phone Just got in the car, me and Teddy are gonna head to my parents now. And I'm actually sweating. Like whenever I'm sleeping at my parents and grabbing Teddy, I have to get my bag, Teddy's bag, my purse. And then I have a bag full of skincare so I can give my mom some stuff. So I have like four bags and I'm literally sweating right now. But we're gonna head over to my parents. I already know there's gonna be a ton of traffic because it's rush hour. So I'm on my way to get my yearly pap smear. So fun. I'm not excited for it, but it's what I gotta do. Which actually, my sister just informed me that I don't need to be doing pap smears every year. Why am I doing them every year? I have no idea, but we're on our way to the doctor. It is 9 10 right now. My appointment's at 9 30, so I gotta go right now. I'm not excited for this. Okay, so I just finished and it's 10 02. It was super quick, it was only like 30 minutes, and I finished everything that bad honestly i always freak out and it's just never that bad but i think i'm gonna get something to eat right now or not i don't know i don't know what i'm doing we'll see but i am getting kind of hungry i came back to my parents i was hoping that there was gonna be food here no i was wrong there's no food whatsoever i'm just posting a sponsored post right now on my instagram and then i'm gonna head out go back to my apartment because your girl's hungry and i'm trying not to waste money but actually today's valentine's day so happy valentine's day my boyfriend's gonna come over tonight and we're just gonna order probably some sushi and then watch a movie and just kind of have a chill night we're not going out tonight i know a lot of people go out for valentine's day but we don't really like big crowds so we just stay in and then either in the weekend or like a few days later we just celebrate like going out or something but i'm starving and i don't want to eat out because we are going to order in food tonight so i'm just gonna try to go home and then make myself a little breakfast burrito and this time i have eggs because last vlog i ran out of eggs but i have eggs this time and we're gonna make a fire breakfast burrito but i'm just posting a sponsored instagram post and then we're gonna go home and make my burrito and by that time i'm gonna be actually starving because i live so far away all right let me finish this and then i'm gonna start packing my stuff and heading home also whenever i leave the house i always put on something for teddy to watch and i put on bluey on youtube they have like a bunch of these live videos i always put on phineas and ferb for him it just it's live so that it'll never like shut off when i'm gone like like if i put on disney plus after a few hours it'll um turn off but on youtube since it's live it just keeps playing and it's awesome Okay guys, it's Valentine's Day, so I'm gonna go real quick to Target and get some stuff for my boyfriend. I'm gonna make him like a little basket. It's gonna be so cute. So we're gonna go to Target and get a few things. 